I'm Natasha Lubchenko. Welcome to today's CT Style Express. In May, President Biden signed into law the Safe Sleep for Babies Act. It bans the manufacture and sale of two infant sleep products. Here with what we need to know is attorney Alex Mario from the Carter Mario Law Firm and her son Carson. <laughs> Alex Carson, thanks so much for joining Thank us. Thank you for having us. Of course. So break it all down for us. What do we need to know about this act? Exactly. So as you just mentioned, in May, President Biden passed this act. And so it is focused on uh, banning the sale and manufacture of two dangerous infant sleep products. One is crib bumpers, which most people know. They're, you know, a very traditional baby product, make the crib look cuter. Um, people think they're, they're, they're comfy, but they're very unsafe. The second product are infant inclined sleepers with an inclined surface of 10 degrees or more. And now you say that, you know, of course every parent wants to keep their child safe, but a lot of people still don't know about this. It is fairly new, but it's been a few months and some people don't know about it. Exactly, and what's what's kind of upsetting is that a lot of people, there's so many items that are constantly being recalled. I feel like every day you wake up and there's another one, you know, um, that people are saying it's unsafe. So it's difficult to keep everything um, in mind when you're shopping. And so when you go to these major retailers and you go on their website and you see one of these items, you assume that it's safe, but you have to remember these retailers are in it for profit and you have to focus on your baby's safety. So, you know, there's a lot of places you can check, but uh, you know, as far as, as far as these two products, just know that they're unsafe, don't buy them, don't sell them. And I mean, it can be tough, right? You go to these major retailers and you expect that everything there is gonna be safe for a baby, but you kind of have to do your own research here. Exactly, and a lot, of, a lot of these major retailers have them still on their sales site. So it's upsetting to see, um, but you know, things are gonna fall through the cracks for a while and it might take a bit for them to be removed. But, but you know, just for everybody to know, just don't buy them in the meantime. Raising awareness, clearly the act was passed for a reason and now exactly. of course you are a parent, Carson, here. Yeah. If parents, you know, want some tips to help their child sleep through the night, do you have any for us today? <laughs> if I don't, um, I wish I did. I guess, uh, you know, I think with, uh, with Carson, he is just, Finally, he, he wakes up a couple times a night, so I would love people to send me tips on how to get their baby to sleep through the night. But um, but yeah, but these items, you know, just to kind of recap, they've been linked to more than 200 um, infant deaths with an wow. increase in suffocation and SIDS. So they're just super dangerous, um, and it's just really good, to, you know, that we're we're both here raising awareness. He's raising awareness to his generation. All right, Alex, Mario, and Carson, thank you so much for the time today and the great information. And of course, you can learn more at CarterMario.com. Thanks for joining us for today's CT. Style Express. I'm Natasha Lubchenko. We'll see you tomorrow.